are good. In today's video, I want to show you finally the futures and uh, my new wheelchair. I know that some of you requested for some time already uh, because I did post it video of how do I take out my wheelchair of the car and how did I you know travel myself I went out uh, one day myself and uh, how did I manage I told you in that video so now I want to uh, yeah, finally tell some more more details about my wheelchair and why did I uh, change it so let's start basically I did change it because the other one even if it was foldable as you guys remember otherwise I do have video about my older wheelchair and uh, you know when did I get it my review about it I did change the wheelchair because uh, I did want it to become more independent and I needed something somehow that I can put my wheelchair into my car myself and that um, you know it took some time to figure it out and um, not only to figure it out to see how a lot of things as you can imagine but in the end I did it because it is something that I need for myself and for the others around me not because they don't want or they mind helping me but because it is better for myself that I do it and that I'm able to also do it myself of course if I'm going or traveling with someone that person that comes with me I'm gonna ask to help me with the wheelchair also because then it's free space next to me uh, so it's more comfortable but I need to be able to also travel myself um, I find it myself very important and maybe some of you can relate to that anyway so uh, this is the wheelchair that you've seen already in uh, two other videos if I'm not wrong so let's start well uh, let's start from the front wheels that are not not something special the front wheels uh, just something normal I, uh, the, the guy that helped me didn't advise me to get the really small uh, thin uh, uh, wheels for, for, for the front because they get into the stones if I'm on a, on a street with uh, you know the stones and etc and then it's more probably for me to fall forward or something like that so I uh, do have these ones and well the foot plate uh, you can see it it is different than the other one I would say that it is not that weird as the other one which I found it more uh, yeah better for for my legs also because this is not that uh, um, open as the other wheelchair it is more close so my legs um, won't uh, you know tra travel uh, easily when I do get spasms because in the other wheelchair was often that my legs were getting spasms and dancing and then also they had enough space to, to do whatever you know? but they, here it's not that much as you can see which is better and hopefully didn't try that yet it might be uh, better also for the transfer from the ground to the wheelchair back but I didn't get to uh, practice that yes, yet because uh, I've been busy also with other things, I'm still busy and going to the color I already said in one of the video but I'm gonna say it again I don't know if you can see correctly or how you can see it from there uh, but it is black and 
it has glitters which I think it makes a bit of difference and I think it is characterized me I wanted something classical but also something that gives you know it's not something that you can see it from far away but the moment you are close you see oh yeah there are glitters so yeah I think it represents me also going to the pillow this time it's just a normal pillow with foam like the guy that helped me uh, choosing and yeah choosing uh, and measured everything for the wheelchair said that if you get used to have the um, rojo pill that usually has the cell airs under uh, as you remember I showed you the rojo pill that I have and your skin will also become really sensitive and the moment I have to sit with my body uh, on a harder place of course my skin will get problems which is true so he said I would suggest this one and I have it now for some time I didn't get any problem and I hope I won't get well I didn't uh, have since my accident any um, skin problem because of sitting or something like that so let's hope for the good the cover it is waterproof I have two covers uh, at the moment and they are both waterproof because sometimes can rain outside, I'm outside and it's just a little bit of rain, you know, and it's it's handy, it's handy that, or perhaps uh, when I'm transferring into the car and it's just a little bit of rain outside, this won't stay wet, which is good for me. I did personalize both covers that I added uh, with the help of my personal tailor I added this thing that is elastic and that uh, helps me pulling out the pillow uh, when I'm transferring into the car because as a quadriplegic it was a bit uh, yeah, hard for me not impossible, a bit hard for me to take the pillow off, put it in the car and all the things so I did this uh, then we have the brakes and I'm coming closer uh, let's see what you can see here the brakes uh, just normal brakes but uh, yeah the one for quite the projects because this is working good for me as you can see then I have the side guards that are removable I did choose like this so I can easily remove them when I'm transferring into my car uh, and easily put them back when going out of the car so I'm not gonna take now one because it's um, harder to put it back the moment I'm sitting in the wheelchair then we are getting to the wheels that are spinnergy and uh, we are talking about the um, push rims and they are this time round if you remember or if you don't remember you can watch again the video of my previous wheelchair the push rims were oval and they had rubber but only in the middle here and for me as a quadriplegic most of all for my right hand wasn't good the grip so when I was pushing uh, it was more difficult for me but this is round and already has rubber on it and if you see also the position of my body is it that my uh, back it's more deep than uh, on the other wheelchair and the guy also added and I really like what he said like you have to sit in the wheelchair and not on top of the wheelchair which 
if you think about really makes sense because this is something that you use daily so you need to sit in a wheelchair because this is part of you this is part of your life this is part of your maybe 14 maybe 16 hours a day so this needs to be comfortable for your body to use it those many hours and the back support is just a normal back support that has been adjusted with straps uh, underneath and it is more uh, harder on the sides and softer in the middle but I can always adjust it also the height uh, mm, maybe higher but I don't think lower maybe a little bit lower uh, but this is okay for me and what is special let's say I would choose this option for the switcher is that it has removable handles this is the place where the handles are going into and I don't have them now they are uh, left in the car sadly but this is where they put uh, the handles as maybe some of you already saw on uh, the, the the post I made on YouTube and uh, I did personalize my wheelchair and now let's see maybe from here I can show you so these are made handmade by a woman that lives in the Netherlands I'm gonna put her website on the description and they are they, they are just beautiful and it is a uh, metal ring that it goes in between uh, yeah in between the push rim and the wheel as you can see I did choose black and gold also because it fits with the wheelchair there was also the possibility to have uh, another mix of color that I liked was blue, dark blue, um, and something else. But the moment I saw this and how they fit on the wheelchair, I said, no, this is what I need. This is what I want for the wheelchair. Let me know what you think about if you like them. And if it does fit me, and the wheelchair so I believe guys that that was most of the things that I had to uh, say about this new wheelchair uh, one thing that I'm working on uh, but will take some time is to make a really good back for the wheelchair but under back wheelchair as you can see, I do have here something, I hope you can see, uh, see, so w here is the back, but it needs to be adjusted to become stronger, so it won't hang down, so that I'm working with my tailor to figure out how big uh, I need it uh, to basically personalize it to my needs but also to the sizes of the wheelchair in that way that it won't bother me when I transfer it in the car of course so that was it guys for today thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe like comment and see you in the next video let me know what you think about and what are your opinions and maybe you have some suggestion about my new wheelchair maybe something else to personalize it let me know and see you in the next video bye <laughs>